Greetings, friends. This is Survival Doc. This is the December 22nd addition to my cancer series. And a thought just came to mind that um, I wanted to get down on video while I was thinking about it, washing the dishes here just a minute ago. Uh, and I've actually introduced this topic in a prior video, so if this is a repeat, uh, I apologize. Um, but it's been a, a, a year now, over a year now, since I first came down with cancer and had the initial cancer, uh, tumor removed, and now I'm dealing with a, a metastasis. Um, and it is, um, the uh, tests are showing that this um, new tumor that I have about the size of a, a pecan in the shell in my gut area um, is not reducing despite our treatments uh, it's still remaining the same uh, so we're still hoping of course that it's going to start responding to treatments and it's going to start uh, shrinking so but this has uh, made me think uh, <clears throat> At first, um, I, my, my um, uh, chiropractor told me at first that I was in denial um, oh, about, about a year ago, and uh, I thought she was crazy, but now looking back on it, I'm thinking, well, maybe she um, was right. I Initially, I don't think I took this um, cancer seriously, um, thinking that, hey, this is something that could kill me. Uh, I just saw it as um, I've, I've been sick before and I've always recovered and I've been very very healthy uh, all my life and lived a healthy lifestyle so I just figured this was something else that I was going to uh, be able to get over well after years time uh, I'm being faced with um, my mortality um, or I'm facing my mortality a little bit more than I was a while back and that made me think you know um, um, <clears throat> this cancer has uh, has really been a blessing in some ways um, and um, and that is you know they they say that when people are about to die um, they report when if they, if they don't die later on they report that they saw their life flash right before their eyes um, in the in the instant that they felt like they were about to die um, and uh, in my case uh, this has been going on for a year and I've, I've had the um, um, the blessing or the um, I've been fortunate uh, enough to not have to have my life flash before my eyes because I've had a whole year for my life to pass before my eyes or, or in other words for me to uh, for me to think about my life uh, and I'm 60 years old now, and I was just washing the dishes, and that's a chore that usually my wife performs. So uh, thank you very much. And um, but she's out of town right now visiting uh, our son and his uh, family. And um, so I was washing the dishes. Not that I never wash dishes, but I mean I was washing a bunch of dishes. And um, it kind of took me back to a time back when I was in college and kind of moved out on my own for the first time and I was renting a house and you know setting up housekeeping for myself and I was um, I would be washing I you know I had my renting a house I had my own kitchen and I was doing my own cooking and that was when I first got into cooking and things and um, and I and I was would be washing my dishes as a bachelor then of course uh, and it made me think back to that time uh, where uh, my life was just kind of um, just getting started and I thought about the time that has intervened 
since then. So I'm talking about a time back in the 70s and what has taken place you know, since the 70s uh, to today. Um, but anyway, um, I've had a lot more time to think about my life and that's that's one thing that um, that this one of the things that this uh, cancer has done is it has it had like uh, it like stopped me dead well not literally dead, <laughs> dead sorry that's a poor uh, that's a poor choice of words no doubt but it stopped me in my tracks um, and then all of a sudden uh, you know, my life was changed, and <clears throat> and I can review my life and not have to have it flash, you know, before my eyes at the last minute. I can take some time uh, to think about uh, my life, and that is just what I wanted to to mention in this um, hopefully short. Uh, video log today in that it this cancer has been a blessing in that it has allowed me to have my life flash before my eyes but at the same time given me a chance to uh, take my time and and look at it and consider it carefully and that's all and this is survival doc reminding you be prepared or be prepared to be fleeced.